I'm so close to like finally being caught up and having everything uploaded so I can like get rid of everything and put it onto like externals and stuff. Because mm-hmm. this stuff's taking up so much space. Oh, for computer. sure. <laughs> and you, see, I could never do that. Yeah. I only have 250 gig. True. What, yeah, you're 750? Yeah, I got 750. Yeah, pretty. All right, well, I mean, I would love to just hear how your week went, because you have so much going on, and I murdered you at the beginning of it, so that must have been <laughs> Yeah. <annoying>. Um, <laughs> so, I mean, Monday went great, but beyond Monday, I've been just bedridden. <laughs> like, and then, of course, I couldn't just be bedridden, because I had to drive Emily to work and pick her up every day, and driving the car is <laughs> not easy yeah. when you can't bend your arms in or out or lift them so it's been an interesting week um finally on thursday i finally went and like i i, I had <coughs> lunch with my sister because like i said i have to meet up with all these people that i'm not gonna be seeing for a while um so i met up and had lunch with my sister and she had to like go to a Walgreens or something so while i was in there i was like you know what i'm gonna take a look and uh I picked up, like, an ice pack thing, like a reusable you put in the freezer, mm-hmm. and I don't know if that's what helped me, but the next day I felt, like, 50% better. Cool. Like, so that helped a lot. Um, it's not the best, because it's this tiny little ice pack, and I needed it for, like, both of my arms <laughs> and my and both of my, like, pecs, <laughs> and it only, la- like, you have to put it in the fridge for, like, or a freezer for, like, two hours just for it to last for, like, ten minutes. Yeah. So... It takes a bit of working to do, but... I hate knockback when you get hit. Yeah. It's the most frustrating gameplay mechanic. But I like when it's not just always a thing, and there's factors in the game that can reduce it. Yeah. <clears throat> I love when in Mega Man, would you, uh, Mega Man X, you'd get the uh, boots, and all of a sudden, like, knockback didn't happen to you, and then you could use those extra, like, three seconds of invulnerability to just slaughter. Oh, jeez. Well, that's good. Yeah, I'm, I, I question if this was on purpose. <laughs> I've never done that before. Pretty slick. So that was a boss fight. We just went through. <laughs> you made it seem easy. Is it just because you know what you're doing? Um, probably part of it. I've uh, actually, out of all the games that we've played, um, this is the one actually that I've kind of played before, like again before we sit down and play it. Yeah. Because I, ha- I have another file going where I just. When I'm bored, I'll pick it up and play it, because I really love this game. Mm. So, like, I'm not super lost when we're going through stuff right now. That's probably good. Yeah. Whereas if I were playing, I'd be like, and dead, and dead, and dead. Probably. <laughs> the game's actually pretty difficult. <clears throat> yeah, like, you don't make it seem that way. Although, except last time, your, your playthrough, you kept getting lost. <laughs> I did? Remember? you? you we... I know I died once, and then I had to backtrack and do a bunch of stuff again. Okay, I guess that's what I call getting lost. Yeah. <laughs> So then, um, if you're feeling better, how are you feeling today? Are you back to 100%? Um, almost. I, I would say I'm like 95. Yeah. Like, I still kind of, if I if I squeeze in a bit, or out, yeah. I still have some pain up here. Mm-hmm. But uh, I think my arms are pretty much there. Um, I might try and do another push-up again today. Just to see. I tried on Friday morning, and I, it wasn't going to happen. Yeah. I fell on my face. <laughs> nice. Good. Five days after Good. <laughs> working out. <Good. laughs> like, now, so for context, Mike, Mike uh, told me that he wanted to get ready for a Navy PT test. It's like, okay, let, let's do this. And so I came over, and he did the sum total of 50 push-ups, 50 sit-ups, and two shuttle runs. Or four shuttle runs, I suppose. Um, <clears throat> yeah. Which was all good. He did well. Most people complain or give up during it. He made it all the way through. But he texted me the next day. He's like, I'm... I've, you, I am dead. Like, there's nothing left of me. <laughs> and we were supposed to do it again on Wednesday. Supposed to do it again on Wednesday, that's right. <laughs> and, like, there's no way that was going to happen. <laughs> so, you know, kind of clue me in on what do you mean that it might take forever to even get into the stage where you'd have to take this test. Oh, right. Um, well, I'm still kind of doing research into what... Because, like, the general PT and, like, boot camp stuff is for enlisted. And I'm going for, for officer. So I know they have different, um, this, not necessarily different standards, but a different, like, path to getting there. And then aside from that, I know that there's, like, a 
I mean, I, I guess I would call it a council, technically. Um, oh yeah. <laughs> Fuck those guys. Why are they dancing? <laughs> they're drowning. And now they're dead. Lol. Um, because I blocked the water with that thing. Um, so I know that there's like, basically like there's a council, and they have to review any applicants to be officers. So, and that council meets like, maybe once a year. Oh. What? And I don't know when. What? Yeah. So, <clears throat> once I actually try get in on like, like, start this process, um, however long that takes to actually put your application and stuff together, and if you need secure security clearance, all that kind of stuff, that all has to happen, and then you get like judged by this council if you can even go to officer school. So like, it's not a quick process. Mm. Um, it's, I mean, really, it's probably designed to, if you really want to do military, just to go enlisted <laughs> and start from the bottom. Yeah. But um, <clears throat> I feel like there's a lot of advantages to school officer. <laughs> sure. And I'll, I'm, uh, that's what I'm going to attempt. And actually, um, we talked with. I guess that was last week. We were talking with uh, Nathan and stuff. Um, so Air Force might also still be a thing. Yeah. Like I mean, I've been talking Navy this whole time and stuff, but that's you know, that's just because that's the one I've been looking at and it seems the most interesting at first look. But I have a lot of research still to do and uh, recruiters to talk to and stuff like that right. to actually get all the information. Because that's how I am. I'm, get all the information you can before you make a decision. Sure. Yeah. Okay, well, you know, see, I was under the impression that, like... It was like, before I left for DC, I needed to be ready. Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> and if that's true, then yeah, like, we had to keep the schedule that we were on. Right. <clears throat> I did want to reconfirm, though, like, I don't get any pleasure out of just literally slaughtering your body. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's just that, like, what what we did was still, like, a warm-up. Yeah. You know? So, there's just a lot Ooh, of room for improvement. That? That is... I don't do that. Um, so, I mean, you know... Next up is literally the next same same thing. Yeah. Like, if we were to do it again tomorrow, we'd have to do the exact same workout. And see, that I am weary about, because I can't have... You should be. <laughs> I can't have this week again, basically. Sure. Um, but you wouldn't. I wouldn't? Yeah, no. Because you've built, you've built muscle this week. Right. Until, as long as you've been consuming protein, like I told you to, you're fine. Mm. That was the hardest. I mean, next, if we do it again tomorrow, you should not throw up, and you should also not... Um, be nearly as sore. You may be still sore, right? But, but like maybe not like till Wednesday, and not till Sunday. <laughs> yeah. So I know you guys are working on moving and everything. So mm -hmm. clue me in on how that's been because there's a lot of progress since just like last week. Yeah. Um. I mean, we're not uh like trying to get everything <clears throat> done super fast or anything, but we don't want it to sneak up on us. So we've um we're still looking for apartments and things like that. And that's sadly that's probably not something that's gonna get figured out until we're um, like there which is going to be stressful because like we're going to get there um, we're driving up like we're taking the car and her parents are going to drive like a U-Haul with all of our stuff in it and we're going to we're going to do the trip in two days it's about 12 hours away or so. Um, so I mean we could do it in one day if we really wanted to but we're going to you know take our time we have to make stops for the cat and like all that kind of stuff mm -hmm. so we're going to do it in two days so we're going to get there, like, on a Saturday morning, and the plan is to have a bunch of, like, apartment, like, appointments lined up, and we'll go and look around, and then, if we like one, we'll, hopefully we'll be able to move in relatively quick. Um, so why, why can't this be done? You, do you have to see it, basically? That's kind of the vibe we're getting. I understand. Yeah. Um, we've already kind of run across, like, some scammy, like, uh postings and stuff. Really? Yeah. So we kind of feel like we need to see it. Um, we do have, like, uh, some friends up there that we can stay a couple days with, mm -hmm. which is our, you know, was the plan, and then if we have a place that we'd like one of them to go look at, we can we can do That'd that. That'd be sick, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, every time, <clears throat> like, it's always other people driving the decision for me. Yeah. Like, when, when we were getting into Rock Lane was Jace. Jace was like, look, here's all the apartments. These are the ones you need to go to. We need to come see if we want to do it. And then for the house, Brittany was like, hey, I found all these different places. Which one looks interesting? Like, so mm. I hate the, I hate the search, but I love the decision process. <laughs> like, I'm, because a lot of people get excited about the search itself. They're like, oh, look at all these amazing places to live. These are the things that I want to do. And I'm just like, nah. Nah, I don't really nah. care. <laughs> so that's why she keeps trying to, like, drag me into the bedroom when she's looking and stuff. Lol. And I'm like, Lol. I just, uh, 
It's like, I really, like, you just as don't long care. as I have some space to do shit. Yeah. <laughs> you really don't care. Place to sleep. That's good. Like, that, it, it was funny because my parents were like, so you're going to move out of the house or, you know, what are you going to do? I was like, you know, it is kind of funny. Like, all I really need is a desk. Yeah. <laughs> and a bed. <laughs> oh, stop. It's fine. So at this point, what's, like, the next step for this coming week? I mean, are you basically going to be all packed up at that point? Um... Yeah, like, we're, we're slowly going through the second bedroom, which is, like, our... Storage room. S- n- supposed to be office, but there's no TV in there, and we both kind of like having TV around us, so we never work in there. Yeah. Um, that was an oversight. Ha! <laughs> going in. I think we expected to buy another TV um, to replace this one. Then this one would have went into our bedroom, and then our bedroom would have gone to the office. Okay. But then we never got that extra TV. Gotcha. So that didn't happen. So yeah, the the office just ended up being like two desks that hold stuff, and then a bunch of other stuff like in the corners, like bookshelves and things. Um, we are looking at like, getting one bedroom when we move, and hopefully we'll have like a solarium or like a den area for a desk. Like, and we'll just share one desk. Mm. Um, so that room's slowly being packed up. That should be done probably by next the end of next weekend. Um, then. This room's already pretty much done with, like, stuff that we're not going to be using for the four weeks before we move. Yeah. So that's that. And then the bedroom, there's probably not even that much to do. It's really just, like, the bed, um, which is the biggest thing that we're actually moving with us. Like, the, the main things that we're taking is the bed and this this awesome coffee table. Mm-hmm. That's our also our, like, dining room table. Yeah. <laughs> um... This thing's gonna be a bitch to take because it's basically one big piece. The only things that come off are the legs. Oh man! And it's super heavy. Uh, Did you just do an, a fire sword move? I don't think so. I yeah. think that was just matching with yeah. his thing. 